As a frequently used dashboard randomly chooses a horrible plan and kills the production server. I tried forcing the plan with Query Store. It works for a while and then fails, says the index it uses no longer exists. But I didn't drop any indexes that I know of. Not sure where I should look next. Well, that's really cool. What you do is you go to the plan, go to the plan that you're forcing, and look at it. Crazy, right? Look at that plan and go see what the indexes are. When you look at the XML of the plan, you're going to be able to see the index ID. And that way, if somebody's changing the index, like if they're dropping it and recreate it, I've seen people do stupid things like their index rebuild scripts decide to drop and recreate the index, or they create a new index and then drop the old one or do it with drop existing. If the ID is changing, that can run you into problems there. I don't think that's what it is. I don't think the index is actually changing, but I think that if you look at the plan, all of a sudden you'll go, oh wait, no, it is asking for an index and somebody else must have dropped that index. So that can help. Also, don't just look at the one table that you think is involved. Look at all the tables in the execution plan because it might be one that you didn't realize somebody was joining to.